Hello my beautiful co-creators, this is Isolde Kalman from Journey of Awe and we are in the middle of the karma cleansing week and as you see that in the process of forgiving I suggested that it's nice to play out the story from both perspectives by the victim of your story and also from the owner of your story and then when we reach the um, end of the forgiveness make sure that you don't put any attachments on the outcome we're not doing this to change people around us. We're not doing this to change or physically control the situation. We are literally divorcing ourselves to the relationship, how we feel about it. And that's the energetic bubble, what we burst. What I would like to add to the forgiveness exercise is when we reach, when you play out the victim part, when you take your story back, then you forgive yourself, you always start with yourself, you forgive yourself for owning the story, for all the suffering that you caused and you caused others by owning the storyline. Then you forgive the other person by saying that I understand you simply played out my story, what I hold within. And then I would like you to apologize or have a statement that says, if I ever hurt you in this lifetime or in other lifetimes, please forgive me. And the reason why, because we addressing this karmic that's not just in this plane of life, we are going back and addressing this in other lifetimes as well, because I can guarantee you there are people who come into your life today, you have a karmic debt, you have a karmic contract that you play out with. And many times it's negative or positive, but as we are doing karmic cleansing this week, we're addressing most of the time of the negative experiences. And when you do this, on the end, simply send them love by with an energetic, have a cord between you and their heart and send them love and light and wish them well and bless them. And again, thank them for playing out your story. But you choose to cut the energetic connection the old dynamics what you had and you choose to rewrite your story because you have a right to rewrite the story or end this relationship where it is today. Again, don't control the outcome because energy is brutally honest. It mirrors back everything what we have inside. And there is a great saying that we only meet but ourselves. That means that we attract of what we have inside. If we have unresolved issues, it's going to come up. These energetic bubbles will come up and burst again and replay the storyline with someone else or with the same person. But if you truly want to have change in your life, go through every person who caused a negative experience to you with no exception. Forgiving doesn't only happen with one person, but I don't forgive Joe, but I forgive Nancy. You have to forgive everyone who comes into your life and let them go. Bless them. Understand that they simply play in your theater of co-creation. Namaste, and I will see you guys next time.